Yeah, actor Mark McKinney, he's here. Uh, is that water? What is that? You're it's, ready to party, aren't you? Yes, with water. With water? <laughs> yeah. Well, they do have a full bar here, so if yeah. you're heading on down here, you can, can get some alcohol. Double. Can get a double? <laughs> uh, Mark, thank you so much for being here with us. You may recognize him from The Kids in the Hall. I mean, uh -oh. I mean, how can you not love that show? I love that show. I, I know. That show. I know. Yeah. Um, so you're here because you're promoting Superstore. Yeah, Superstore. Talk about Superstore for those who don't know okay. that show. Superstore yes. is an American sitcom uh, on NBC on Thursday nights. And it's about the life, uh, the, the work family that you have in a place like a uh, Walmart or a Costco. And uh, I play the uh, manager, I'm not the manager this season because I decided to step down because I'm having a baby. Oh, okay. Well, uh, I've watched the show and uh, it's very relatable. Yes. The comedy. Yes, it is. Talk about that. Well, that's because, uh, well, people uh, confirm that, Stella. They say that people, we hear a lot from people who work in these uh, in, in these big box stores saying, you nailed it. Yeah, the comedy you know. is really good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, why did you take the part? Because, I mean, there is some bad comedy out there. Uh, well, there was no bad comedy available, so I decided to try <laughs> good comedy. That's good. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you know, it was just, I auditioned and, and I read the script and Justin Spitzer had done this incredible job and the character just kind of left out on the page and so... You're like, I'm going with it. I put in, I put my hat in the ring and I, and I got it. Hey, the Kids in the Hall. Yeah. Talk about that show. I mean, oh, we love the guys. Are you guys still friends? Yeah, actually I wrote them this morning because I was running into so many Kids in the Hall fans uh, uh, up around the convention center. I just emailed everyone and said, we uh -huh. got to do this. we got to do a Kids in the Hall. You're, you're up on a billboard too here. How does that make you feel? Uh, it makes me feel approximately 17 feet high. <laughs> <laughs> You're sort of a big deal, you know? <laughs> um, so, Kids in the Hall, back to that. Right. How did that show come together? Well, the show came together because we uh, were lucky enough to come to the attention of Lorne Michaels. The group came together because we were a bunch of sort of comedy rejects in Toronto. <laughs> who wanted to kind of do our own little weird comedy, and we stuck with it long enough till someone saw us. And that's kind of how we did it. And it paid off. It did pay off eventually. Not in millions, but hundreds. Doesn't matter, <laughs> we'll take it, you know what I mean? Uh, back to Superstore. Um, not only are you an actor, uh, mm -hmm. you're now dabbling into directing. Oh, yeah, I should have brought my DGA card to show you. <laughs> we yes. believe you. Yeah, I am. I'm you in the Director's Guild of America. You directed an oh, episode yeah. called Lovebirds. Yes, I did. It's a great episode uh, because for years we've been hearing about uh, 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 Lauren Ash's uh, Birds. You yeah. know, she plays Dina, my arch rival. And uh, one day, she, because of a, a, a recent storm, she brings them to work, and they all get out. Okay. Yeah. Was it a tough episode to, to direct? There were live birds. Yeah, there were I know. Seventeen I... live birds. Oh my gosh. And then a big section where we had to imagine seventeen live birds. But I was terrified on the Monday morning, and I couldn't have been happier by the Friday afternoon. My crew, yeah. I want to say it again. Thank you. Mission Thank accomplished. You all went yeah. well. Yeah. Uh, quickly, before we wrap up, you do have a panel tonight, right? Yes. For Superstore. Yes, we have a panel back at the Hilton. If you want to come by, please do. And we also have a uh, fan experience happening right across the street here at the Hard Rock Cafe. It's open all weekend. Come to Cloud Nine and uh, pick up some swag. 